If you've been struggling with hair loss, you've probably heard about low-level laser therapy or red light therapy. But does it actually work and what's the science behind it? Today we're going to do a deep dive into how red light therapy can stimulate hair growth and the wavelengths that make it effective. Let's get into it. So what exactly is low-level laser therapy? It is a non-invasive treatment that uses low-powered lasers to stimulate hair follicles. It's FDA approved for androgenetic alopecia and other types of pattern hair loss in both men and women. Unlike other treatments, it doesn't involve chemicals or surgery. Instead, it's all about the light. These devices emit light in the red to near-infrared spectrum, typically between 630 and 850 nanometers which penetrate the scalp to energize hair follicle cells. Now, it's very important to note that it needs to be at this range. So if you're looking for a hat, look between the 630 to 850 nanometer range. Now let's break down the science. Low level light therapy works by targeting mitochondria, which is the powerhouse of your cells. The red light is absorbed by a protein called cytochrome C oxidase in the mitochondria. This boosts the production of ATP, the energy currency of your cells. More ATP means more energy for your hair follicles to grow thicker and healthier. Red light therapy also increases blood flow to the scalp, delivering oxygen and nutrients to the follicles. It even reduces inflammation, which can play a role in hair thinning. Now, not all light is created equal, and for red light therapy to work, the wavelength of light is critical. So research shows that wavelengths between 630 to 670 nanometers are ideal for penetrating the upper layers of the scalp, while anything from 810 to 850 nanometers can actually go deeper and target the stem cells of the hair follicles. This range ensures that the light reaches the hair follicle bulge area where the magic of the hair regrowth actually happens. But does it actually work? Studies show that consistent use of red light therapy can increase hair density and thickness by up to 30% in six months. Devices like laser caps and combs are backed by clinical trials showing significant improvements in androgenetic alopecia. For example, one study found that using a red light therapy device for just 25 minutes, three times a week, led to visible results in just 12 weeks. Now, low-level light therapy isn't a magic wand. It works best for people in the early to moderate stages of hair loss. If your follicles are completely dormant or scarred, the results may be limited. And remember, consistency is key. It's also important that you're on other therapies as well to prevent the root cause of the hair loss. So how does low-level light therapy stack up against other treatments like minoxidil? Stick around for my next video where I'll compare these two popular options and share how you can combine them for maximum results. Thank you for watching. If you like this video and you found it helpful, please press the like button. Otherwise, subscribe and follow us for more.